Hi, I'm Ryan Kadri, Director of Automotive Technology and Mobility Innovation at the Ontario Centers of Excellence, and I head up the Autonomous Vehicle Innovation Network. I'm here today with Dennis Burkov, Business Development and Product Manager for Ecamion. Dennis, can you tell us a bit more about Ecamion? We originally started off as, man as a manufacturer of energy storage systems. Since then, we've branched off into very innovative electric vehicle charging solutions, including those for autonomous cars. Tell me a little bit more about charging systems for autonomous vehicles. There's going to be a need for that because if you're not driving, probably could still fill up the gas tank or, or charge the vehicle, but we talk a little bit more about that. Figuring out the charging problem, how do you charge those autonomous vehicles, is, it's not an easy thing. There's really two ways to go about it. There's the inductive wireless charging, where a car needs to park on top of a charging pad. Usually there's quite a bit of losses associated with that. But for example, if you charge your phone on an inductive charging pad, you're only getting 60-70% efficiency, and then 30% of energy is wasted. So what, what we're doing is a conductive char charger for electric autonomous cars. The idea there is to pair a conventional electric vehicle charger with a robotic arm. The car is going to drive up to this autonomous electric vehicle charging station, and the, the arm automatically is going to attach itself into it. Can you tell us, do you have any customers right now, any sales, any projects that are going on that are interesting? Maybe talk about that a little bit. As far as the conventional electric cars go, we have a deployment happening right now along the Trans-Canada Highway from Ontario to the west bo western border of Manitoba. We are installing 34 charging stations along that highway, roughly 100 kilometers apart from each other. So enab enabling people who drive electric cars to go from, um, say, Toronto to Manitoba. We're also deploying these charging, charging uh, stations in uh, downtown urban cores uh, in Toronto and uh, other cities in Canada. Why did you choose to do that here in Ontario? Our headquarters is in Scarborough. All of our employees are there, our manufacturing is there. We, we view ourselves as a very vertically integrated company. So Ontario has always been a home for us and we don't want to go anywhere else really. What's your global growth opportunity? Where do you see the future of your company in the next few years? Everybody's talking about going away from conventional gasoline cars by a certain date. Some cities will not allow any gasoline cars by 2030 or 2040. So the, the future is definitely right for electric vehicles. And electric vehicle charging is a very important aspect of bringing, the, bringing that vision into practice. We have uh, future proofness in mind in a way that all the, all the charging stations that go out can be converted into charging stations capable of charging autonomous vehicles. Another great Ontario company building infrastructure for the next generation of vehicles right here in Ontario and creating jobs.